Anastasia.com. Today I'm going to show you how to crochet a handbag and then use the fulling process to create a felted look. To do this, I'm using 400 yards of 100% sheep's wool from Kristen Omdel's Be So Brave yarn collection. A portion of all sales of this beautiful yarn benefits Project Kristen Cares. And I'm using a size K hook. To begin, make a slip knot and then chain 51. In the second chain from the hook, make three single crochet stitches and then mark the first one. Do one single crochet in each of the next 48 chains. At the last chain, do three single crochet stitches. On the other side of the chain, do one single crochet in each of the next 48 chains. You can see how we worked on both sides of the chain. Remove your marker and then do one single crochet. Continue with one single crochet stitch around. We will be working in spirals so you will not need to chain one or do any slip stitches. Just keep going around and around and around. One single crochet around in every stitch. You can see what this looks like. It's best to always mark that first stitch. Just keep crocheting around. If you want to change to a new color, cut your yarn. And then insert this new color and create a single crochet stitch. Just keep crocheting around now with this new color. You can see how the handbag starts to bend up to form a pouch now. After completing 37 rows in any color order you wish, this is what your handbag looks like now. Next, we're going to make the button flap. Measure to find the center and mark it. Count over eight stitches and start your single crochet stitch. Continue making single crochet stitches across. You will have a total of 17 stitches for the flap. Chain one, turn your work, and just do single crochet stitches back and forth for 15 rows. Now we are going to do the fulling process, which basically shrinks this handbag. Place it in a lingerie bag or a zippered pillowcase. Kristen has a gentle wash she created for Yucalan called Rapture. Place your handbag in the washing machine. Set it to small load and hot water. Add the wool wash and let it agitate for five minutes. Keep checking it every five minutes to see if it's ready. After 15 minutes, mine is ready. You can sew on the handle and measure for your buttonhole. Because wool that has been fooled is very dense and won't unravel, we can use our scissors and cut a buttonhole. You can see how we can easily fit a button through. 
And that is how you can create a felted looking handbag using crochet and the fulling process. To view this video in other languages, click on the closed caption link on YouTube and turn on subtitles. From there, you can choose from over 100 different languages. I hope this video has helped you. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Feel free to like and comment on this video. Check out the description or the info button of this video for more information. And please visit Nastasia.com for more tips and tricks on creative, self-sufficient living.